Hello, welcome back to STEM School. Today we are going to talk about multiplication as repeated addition. Now let's take a look what we have here. Okay, we do have two walnuts. Okay, I'm eating two walnuts per day. So, how many walnuts do I eat a whole week, which is seven days, right? So, I got two for Monday, two for Tuesday, two for Wednesday, two for Thursday, two for Friday, two for Saturday, and two for Sunday, which in total we've got seven twos, right? So, seven twos. So, then we got two plus two. Plus two plus two plus two plus two plus two, which we got fourteen, right? So the total fourteen walnuts I eat every week. So how can we represent this in another way? Which we got two walnuts per day, and we got seven times, right? So seven times of twos. So we use x to represent the multiplications, right? So seven times two, which equals the two plus two plus two plus two plus two plus two plus two above, which equals actually fourteen. So let's take a look at another example. Okay, we got three times six, right? So we can write it as six plus six. Plus six, right? So three times of six, so we can add what two six. That's twelve, right? Six plus six is twelve, and twelve plus six is which is eighteen. So that three times six is eighteen, right? So let's take a look at another one. So five times four. Right, so actually we can write it as four plus four plus four plus four plus four. So five times, right? And we once we add them together, we got twenty, right? We got twenty. So four plus four is eight. Eight plus four is twelve. Twelve plus four is sixteen, and sixteen plus four is twenty, right? So we got twenty here. So let's try another way. So this time we're gonna try four times. Five, right? It's exactly opposite. So five times four. What? That's what we've calculated、uh, previously, and now we calculated four times five, right? So we got five plus five plus five plus five. So four times five, right? So five plus five, we got ten, and ten plus five, we got fifteen, and fifteen plus five, we got twenty again. So that's exactly the same, right? So. So we will see from no, we can see from here that five times four equals four times five. So, so are they always the same? So let's explore that in another lesson. That's everything for today's lesson. Please click like if you like this video and subscribe my channel. Thank you.